Hi everyone, it's Emilia here. Today I want to create a wedding card. This is a, a card created with a Lemon Craft Elegance Collection, but um, it's actually featuring those uh, dies from Elizabeth Craft Design. This is the planner die actually. But I thought, when I saw that uh, design, I thought, oh, it would be perfect for my long um, cards. And it, it is uh, McCrame and Page. It is for journaling, like I said, but I use it for my card and it looks uh, absolutely stunning. I love that set and I love that element you will see it uh, in a second when i will die cut it before sticking to the cut it's so so gorgeous and i added some flowers and this way i have a super pretty cut i use that uh, page die to die cut the top and the bottom uh, of my second layer it all looks very very pretty so I hope I will inspire you and maybe you have that set but you you know you maybe you use it for journaling and then you decide that you would like to create a card so I'm hoping with that video I will just inspire you to create something similar so like I said for the card I'm using lemon craft elegance paper collection and I'm just taking one um, paper and for the uh, make rain I'm just uh, going to die cut it out of white card. The second layer for the card is eight and half centimeter wide and uh, this is just um, right size so I'm not reaching the holes on the uh, side of the dies when I want to die cut it because I just want to uh, die cut the top and the bottom of my uh, strip and if you will be looking for the measurements please check the description box below the video and I will also provide the links uh, to the products there. I'm going to adhere the first layer to the card using glue. It will just go flat to the card base and for the second layer I will use a piece of chipboard to create a dimension between the layers and uh, for the chipboard just um, keep it shorter than your uh, layer because on the top and on the bottom of the layer I want to add a piece of lace. So I need that space so I can um, have it under my top layer. I'm sorry I have a, a little bit of composition built already on the card. I didn't realize the camera wasn't working, but I will explain you what I did so far. So first of all, I have attached that uh, McCrane piece. I only uh, uh, attached it use, uh, on the, in one place like you could say in the center of it so I am able still uh, to lift the bottom and top layer of that white uh, element and then I added two big flowers um, and one smaller and as you can see I am just uh, adding the leaves so I one of the leaf on the top is under the pink flower and on the and the little uh, leaves are actually under that uh, McCrame uh, embellishment the die cut so I will just uh, have some leaves stuck under that uh, that piece so uh, this will create very layered dimensional composition and you know if you are watching my video that I love layers and uh, also I keep that bottom um, part loose, uh, the bottom part of the McCrame, so you know it will, so I can, it's not completely flat, so I can kind of bend, bend it, I could say, 
it gives a really nice um, result it looks absolutely lovely on the card it is delicate piece so uh, probably the card would have to go in the box i mean all of my cards um, goes into the boxes because they are quite uh, high you can <laughs> you can say because of the layers and the flowers all flowers I made myself. The big uh, white rose is made out of Fumiran and the pink, uh, the, the little pink flowers as well, but the bigger pink flower is made out of fabric. I used Lady E Design cutting dies to create all flowers and to die cut all the leaves. I will just put uh, the names of the dies I used also in the description box below the video. So I will be finishing the card in the minute. I'm going to add some splats. Of course you can uh, skip that step if you want to have a really nice uh, clean card. And then I will be adding a little bit of clear glitter. This is a uh, quite thick glitter it doesn't add color because it's clear <laughs> obviously but it adds a really nice touch to the flowers and also it, it's like you know they look like frosted but i love that uh, but of course if you don't like glitter you don't need to do it and this will be it for today i hope you like the card i I just love them both. You can see that I have created very similar uh, compositions um, going just different directions, but I'm so, so pleased with the result. And um, yes, that will be it. Thank you very, very much for watching. Please follow me on uh, Facebook and Instagram. You will find the links below the video. And if you uh, use my tutorials, please tag me on social media, Emilia Shiradzan. Thank you again. Have a lovely creative day. Bye!